Welcome to Web Application Development with TMS Web Core in Embarcadero Delphi. My name is Holger Flick and I'm an evangelist of TMS software and also the owner of Flix Engineering LLC in the United States. Let's start with an introduction what TMS Web Core is. You build web client applications, meaning the applications run completely on the client, the application is being downloaded from a web server, there is no backend that is part of your web application per se. You will use Object Pascal and the Delphi IDE to make these applications and everything is going to be object oriented and follows the rapid application development approach. Your pages can either be designed completely in the form designer, can use HTML or they can be mixed. You can use some elements from the form designer in Delphi and some elements from HTML or CSS, of course, which I consider here part of HTML. The end product of a TMS Web Core application is a JavaScript application. Thus, you can use any existing JavaScript framework in your TMS Web Core applications. Deployment is very easy. There is simple XCopy deployment. There is no libraries you depend on, and that makes TMS Web Core the perfect solution for any web server. Actually, the only thing you need is something as simple as a Raspberry Pi with a web server running on it, and this device will be able to be a web server for your web core applications. To be in par with any other solution from TMS software, it is easy to include any web services or other cloud services, meaning it is an open framework. Right now, there are three classic targets that you can build. First of all, the classic web client application that allows you to deploy the application to a web server so your users are able to access this client application using a URL. However, mobile applications become more and more important, thus TMS Web Core also offers a template for PWA progressive web applications that can be installed on mobile devices like iPhones and Android devices. And finally, in one of the latest releases of TMS Web Core, you're also able to build desktop applications for Windows, macOS, and Linux. This is facilitated by using the Electron framework, which makes it possible to develop web applications and deploy them on the desktop. You might even use Electron applications without actually realizing it. For example, Microsoft Visual Studio Code, not Visual Studio, Visual Studio Code uses Electron to make it possible to use Visual Studio Code on Windows, Mac OS, and Linux. Another big application that's rather common here in the United States is Intuit QuickBooks. That is also an Electron application and thus available for Mac OS and Windows. Before jumping into the demonstration, let's look at the architecture at the front end and the back end of a modern web application. This architecture, of course, is followed by TMS Web Core. The first request to the URL of your application will download the JavaScript application to the client of your user. Of course, the browser will notice if there have been changes to the application and will update if necessary. Then, all the further interaction of the application usually is on the client. You only need to access the web server again for access to REST services or other microservices that facilitate database operations. For example, if you want to display a list of customers or a list of products, this list has to be retrieved from a web service or another web server and thus requires another GET request to the server. This server, of course, can be a completely different server that your web application is hosted on. Here we are inside of the Delphi IDE and after installing TMS Web Core, we get lots of templates to create the different types of application. The simple web application, the PWA application, and the desktop web electron application. I intentionally said desktop web electron application because the application that you're going to create is designed to be a desktop application. I have not mentioned so far that it is very easy to migrate a existing web application to an Electron application, so you will be able to build a web application and an Electron application at the same time with the same code base. We're rather limited with our time in this code rage session, so I'm just going to create a very simple TMS web application to show you how easy it is to build web applications using the rapid application development approach. Just as you're used to from Delphi, you have the controls in your tool palette and you have a button 
and a web edit. And you also have access to certain RTL functions. So this simple demonstration will show the text of the edit in a message box. Let's proceed as if it would be a normal Delphi desktop application. We modify the properties of the controls by setting the text to a name by default. We name the control txt name. We name the button button message. And we give the button a caption show exclamation mark. Now we need to implement the code behind the button. We double click the button. We get the button message click event. And just like we're used to from the VCL, we can use the show message command, which is being transferred to the web for the browser. And what we want to show is the txt. We get full code completion txt name dot text. And that's all there is. We can run the application right inside the IDE. Debugging is of course possible. So here you see the application running in the browser. The name Bruno is entered. Let's overwrite it with Holger show. And here's the message box with the name Holger in it. Let me just give you a brief, brief overview for the standard components. You have what you're used to from the VCL. You have labels, buttons, edits, list boxes, combo boxes, radio boxes. And of course, you have more complex controls to align components with panels, grid panels. You have different buttons with icons. We have grids. And of course, you also have components. This is something I can't dive into at all to support CSS and, for example, frameworks like Bootstrap to get intuitive modern layout for your web pages. You also get more advanced controls like Google Maps access to Google Drive, display YouTube videos, Twitter, Google chart integration, CAPTCHA integration, PayPal integration. This is all included in the basic set. Also included in the basic set is the jQuery controls that you can use to use jQuery controls or to be more precise, the JQ widgets, which are a framework that supports jQuery inside of your web applications. I think we all agree that five to 10 minutes does not suffice to present a product like TMS Web Core completely. Thus, we provide you with a URL web.tmssoftware.com, which allows you to browse all the features, frequently asked questions, online demonstrations, and of course, lots of video content, how to work with TMS Web Core. Thank you very much for your interest in TMS Web Core. Again, here is the URL web.tmssoftware.com for videos, tutorials, trial versions, and so much more.